Well, we've got a very mild Wednesday on the way. Could be our warmest day since late November. We'll take a look at how unusual it is to go that span without hitting 40 degrees. We're missing a big storm tomorrow to the south and east, and then some changes may be on the way next week. So it's worth taking a look at our snow depth from several days ago, because this is going to be kind of the before picture. Uh, as our thaw is going to definitely eat away at this snowpack, especially in the southern part of the state. And midwinter, the snowpack can matter in terms of how warm we get, but now we're heading to that time of year where the sun gets pretty strong. And the snow we do have in southern Minnesota is pretty dirty, so it absorbs a lot more sunlight than a fresh snowpack. So it looks like we'll be right around 40 today for the Twin Cities in southeastern Minnesota, way above normal by about 15 degrees, some spots. Uh, 20 degrees above normal in portions of northern Minnesota with temperatures just in the 30s there. That tells you uh, just how, how mild it is, even though it, it is February. We're still in the first half where uh, those very warm temperatures aren't quite as common just yet. But the last time we hit 40 was November 28th. Here's the 40 line. And you can see we've been close a bunch of times. Much of January was, of course, a very mild month. It was consistently mild, though. It wasn't because we had big spikes in temperature. It's because it was uh, consistently in the 30s and 20s. Now, normally, the last 40 is December 17th, and our first one of the seasons, January 24th, a 38-day span. Historically, there was 51 days between those two dates. Uh, and if we hit 40 today, that'll be a 72-day span between those 40, so that's pretty long. So here's the storm we're missing tomorrow, very much just clipping southeastern Minnesota. Some snow showers for us with a cold front and a clipper coming in on the uh, back side of that system. That's what will affect us with a, just a few snow showers Thursday. And literally one county, Houston County in Minnesota, is under the winter storm watch. This is mainly going to be an Iowa and southern Wisconsin storm. And it will be substantial snowfall for some. We're talking about maybe around a half foot to eight inches of snow around Madison, Wisconsin Rapids, uh, some of those areas, and then into uh, just north of the Quad Cities in Iowa. But for most of Minnesota, we're talking just a coating of snow from the clipper and cold front coming through. And it's going to get our attention. The wind will be back tomorrow after uh, a light wind day today. Winds will be pretty gusty, especially in western Minnesota tomorrow, as a brief shot of cool air comes in with that clipper. Wind gusts around 30 in the Twin Cities tomorrow, but uh, southwestern Minnesota, 40 to 50 mile an hour wind gusts. Uh, so it is going to be quite breezy out of the northland northwest as that cooler air moves in. And temperatures will be briefly cooler, but really close to normal. Normal highs about 26, 27 degrees will be probably 23 or so in the Twin Cities. And pretty consistently in the 20s across the state, literally one day. Saturday, we're back up into the 30s pretty much statewide. So here's that one dip. This is looking at forecast temperatures for the next 10 days. We stay in the 30s, maybe even 40 early next week. And then a dive next week. There are some changes on the way. One of those could be a more active pattern. People have been posting on social media this. This is the American model, which you should put almost no faith in past a week because it is just not a very accurate model. One run gave us a big dumping of snow across Minnesota, but the, all the other runs are all over the place. So don't get excited about it or depressed. Either way, uh, it is hardly uh, a sure thing for next week. But there will probably be a storm somewhere in the central U.S. Around 40 for the high today. Again, that could be the first one in 72 days. Windy tomorrow, still mild in the 30s uh, with a few snow showers in the afternoon. Again, not much to speak of here. Might get a couple inches though down around La Crosse. And then cooler briefly on Friday, back into the 30s, a very nice looking weekend here for February. And then close to 40 again Tuesday, but again, that may not last. We may see temperatures dip a little closer to uh, realistic numbers next week.